All right, here we go again. Like and strive your drivel of gaming. We need to figure out how we can uh, reload our guns in Onward. Apparently, if I go into the Pico 4 VR headset and launch virtual desktop and then go into the game section, it doesn't work. However, when I launch Steam VR right now from the virtual desktop, so you, you start a virtual desktop in Pico 4 VR, then you go over towards your desktop on the PC. You press the button launch Steam VR, which is on the bottom left. And then you go onto Onward right in here. Maybe that seems to be the problem. This was never the case with the Oculus Quest or the Meta Quest 2, I should say. Now we need to figure out if this is really the thing, because I started a game through the games tab the games tab inside the virtual desktop app this time i started it through launch steam vr and then chose the game inside steam vr itself when i do this we should technically now be able to reload our gun because just before this when i started this video i did the other thing what i just mentioned and we could not reload our gun so we're gonna go into suburbia this is actually the video quality uh, we cannot change to a wider oh my god a wider view uh, we cannot change certain other things of the um, you can you can put the the graphics or the resolution a little bit higher but you can only do one eye apparently or you can do both eyes but that's that's gonna suck but Apparently this is just how it's going to be. You can hear the microphone, you can see the video quality. Okay, check it out. It works. So even though Virtual Desktop says that you need to launch a game from the Games tab inside Virtual Desktop itself, the launcher, this is not a good idea for Onward. In Onward, you actually need to launch Steam VR first and then choose Onward inside Steam VR in the hub. So don't use the Virtual Desktop app for starting a game, use Steam VR. You can probably use any other single game that works, but this game did not want to have the reload function ready. Now, as I'm recording, I can tell you right now, it's a lot more fluid, even though I'm recording. When I was using the game uh, from virtual desktop itself, it really didn't work that well. It wasn't fluid, now it's fluid. It's a lot more fluid. Sure, it still has a little bit of frame drops because I am recording and playing at the same time and talking to everybody else on YouTube. But now it seems to work a lot better. Oh, they're over there. That's another dude. He should have been dead. Okay, doesn't matter. Do we have a nade? We do, actually. Just gonna walk through. Still have some ammo in there, which is weird because it should just render itself down, which it's it's not doing that. Uh, it only shows you the empty clip or a full clip, which kind of sucks. But then again, it's pretty cool. Take off the two times scope, and it's just walking forward right now. So again, onward is still a very cool game in my opinion. Uh, they did lower every. Uh, aspect of resolution and uh, certain things in the game like you can't pick up the enemy's weapons anymore on the floor and things like that but you know it's still a cool looking game and it works really well if you launch it in the correct way I think it has to do with that uh, Steam VR is tricking um, the Pico 4 VR headset into thinking that it's a, a Meta Quest 2 that's what I think at least but, oh, yeah, frame drops. I was moving too fast into the new area where it needs to be rendered. Um, I still think I need to kill that dude at the car area for other dudes to spawn in. I think he should be here somewhere. Even if he's still there, maybe he's just, maybe he's bugged out? No. I think he started walking. Oh, no, he's still here. Can we kill him with a knife? Oh, 
a grenade. strafing in this game. I don't know why. I think that's a lot. I feel like I'm a skateboarder in this game sometimes, you know? Where's the bad guy at? There he is. Can we kill him with the knife? Drop the mag. Okay, well this seems to work just fine. Um, it's really weird though. So again, for anybody that has problems with the Pico 4 VR headset and Onward and Virtual Desktop streaming wirelessly from their PC to the headset, go into Virtual Desktop, open up Virtual Desktop on your PC. Uh, you should do that first and then open up the app on your uh, Pico 4 VR. And then press the button that says Launch Steam VR and then choose onward so if i'm correct and i press this button no still thinks we have quest 2 controllers this is a dead get a uh, uh, dead giveaway if you christ i sound like daffy duck this or a porky pig um if you have the oculus quest 2 controllers in your screen in your vision um, then that should be good if you have black controllers with no rings on there or whatever then you know you can't reload the game or reload the uh, the gun. So that's pretty funny. So I can go over to the MK18, which is still my favorite gun. We can recenter, which is apparently not working. Let's look that way. Oh, yeah, I understand now why it's not working. Come on. Jesus Christ. Okay, um, recenter. Yep, there we go. This should be good. All right, so now, is it gonna drop? Yep, oh crap, that was not fast enough. Okay, that works. Really happy with that, that we figured it out. Um, so that's good. That's something that I definitely need to uh, keep in mind. I'm glad we figured it out though. Um, the problem I have with this gun though, is that the, the bud or the stock, it's so short that when I put it next to my shoulder like in real life, the gun starts twitching over here, which sucks. But, you know, we'll make do. Oh! Crap. We have more. Don't have a grenade in my boobs? No, we don't have a grenade in my boob pouch. Boob. Son of a bitch. The fucking grab button. Oh fucking grab button really doesn't work that well apparently we still have a full clip according to this gun that I just shot like 16 bullets with or something or 10 no bad guys oh, it's still dropping frames yeah so recording and playing at the same time is actually a no-go what you should do is actually use OBS on your PC and try to strain your PC a little bit more instead of the uh, the headset, the VR headset, because that's just a no-go. Um, but yeah, again, everything else seems to work just fine. I'm still very pissed off that right now at the point of my gun, like really just above the suppressor, there is a recording button. It says a little, it's like an, an oval little red thing with a white button in the middle or on the left side and it says REC on the right side of it and it's constantly in my view which is really freaking annoying so I hope the Pico 4 people will update that to like a little red button or something and put that away like further up or down or at your feet or whatever I don't give a shit as long as it's not in my field of view when I'm trying to look for people because it's annoying as hell so, I still don't know where the bad guys are. Maybe it's a good idea to just throw this mag away. 
put a different one in with more bullets. Still don't know where these ass wipes are. Let's see if we can find an ammo box and then call this video off till the end. Here's the ammo box. Nobody here. Oh, we got, oh, we got one clip. That's nice. We got a clip for this. That's not gonna work, I suppose. Throwing the smoke. Take the flashbang with me. We don't need syringes because we already have two. Let's see if they flock towards the smoke. Oh, I think they just spawned in. Throw your grenade, asshole. Is he gonna die? Oh, I thought the grenade was gonna go off. Yeah, well, everything seems to work now. Um, so that's great. So I'm gonna leave the video here. I hope everybody uh, will like and subscribe again to my channel because subscribing towards me or towards my channel helps me out a lot. Um, we ordered a Tifa doll from Final Fantasy 7, if people didn't know this yet, which is gonna be unboxed on my channel. This is in uh, collaboration with a website called sexymalina.com. Uh, I just installed a Sparco racing seat uh, in my drift car, so we're slowly um, also upgrading our drift car and hope to be drifting soon again, making some videos as well, cool cars and everything around that. And uh, yeah, in the meantime, I'm still trying to uh, play around with the Pico 4 VR and see what that's like. So uh, yeah, I'm really happy that I actually figured this out myself, that we now are able to reload our guns without any problems and that the buttons work. Again, the trick is to see the MetaQuest 2 controllers because apparently the Pico 4 VR um, has a MetaQuest 2 soul. <laughs> I don't know. But yeah, uh, any, anything else you'll see on my channel, please like and subscribe, like I said, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Thanks for watching, and uh, yeah, have a good one. Peace! No more war. Peace, please.